are ready to go round one here at Sphere in Las Vegas, Nevada. Every single fighter on this roster was asking on this Noche UFC card, and we only have so many slots. What a unique experience for all of these fighters competing here tonight. McGregor dusted Jose Aldo in 13 seconds. Aldo gets his rematch tonight. Finally, we've been pining for a rematch. We finally get it. The great Conor McGregor versus the great Jose Aldo. It does not get any better than this. Oh, nice strike by McGregor there. I mean, Conor McGregor is a fantastic striker, and once again, that skill is on display. manage distance as efficiently and as well as Conor McGregor and there's that left hand finding its home early. Oh, he does a great job of setting you up man. You saw it in the Jose Aldo fight. The guy will just step back a little bit and bang drops the straight left on you that can end your night. He not only throws this fast he also is so accurate and that allows him to finish so many fights. the space so that he doesn't get finished. Big right hand. Well, he continues to save his... Oh! job at least staying upright on that. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. McGregor getting tattooed by that stiff jet. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. Second round, straight ahead. All right, so that round is in the books. Aldo's bleeding from the forehead here a bit. Hopefully they can get that under control so it doesn't trickle down into his eyes in the next round. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants Ready, to fight. get the desired finish. Ready. Round two here. Great punch. Man, that Conor McGregor left hand is just an absolute piston and it lands again. It's like an attaboy. He hits people and they fall down. And he understands the power that he possesses. So he's willing to throw it over and over again. I just keep thinking back to him and Eddie Alvarez, how every time he hit him, he just knocked him out of his shoes. Conor McGregor's left hand is as good of a single strike as there is in the UFC. Yeah, he needs to register that. <laughs> oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Oh, that is a furious inside leg kick. Oh, huge strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. 
67 total strikes. Oh. Oh. Just over three minutes to go. Aldo's limping. That would suggest that the leg kick is having the desired effect. Back and forth we go. Superman punch lands. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Under a minute to go. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. stunned because to watch a young athlete have a performance like this was really amazing the finishing instincts his ability to close the show it was next level it was amazing john